what's up YouTube so I just want to make a quick video about a a dream that I had I can't get all the way into the camera for some reason but I, I, I want to make a quick video about a dream that I had about two days ago today is July 21st I had this dream July 19th or maybe July 18th whatever Monday was but basically the dream was um um, I had a vision actually first of all the reason why I'm doing this video is because I I looked on YouTube and I saw other people that had the same similar vision the same similar dream that I had and that's almost almost even to the T so I decided to go ahead and make this video I'm trying to get in the camera I'm tr um, I decided to make this video just to, to add to it. Uh, maybe this will confirm what other people have seen. Um, but basically the dream was, I was in New York City, right? I was in New York City and um, there was a war, a war raging. Like the skies were like a purplish orange color and the sky was just raging. I, I saw, so many planes I, i've never seen so much planes and missiles in my life it's, it's so much of it in the sky and so in the dream the there were in new york city the planes were falling over and people couldn't get out of the city and so basically everybody was trapped so uh i was trying to get out like everybody else um so one part of the dream i was walking down the street well, I wasn't walking, I was running down the street like everybody else. And someone mentioned my name. And there was a soldier on the, on the right side, a female soldier on the right side of me, who turned around and asked me, she said, what is your name? And I told her my name, and she said, you're gonna help us uh, get out of here. Now, at that point, I didn't really want to join the military because, you know, I, I, I was just a regular civilian. I just trying to, I was trying to get out like everybody else. But I decided to go ahead and join. So, cause I was like, you know, everybody's trapped. So I might as well just go ahead and join the forces and help these people get out. Especially if they feel that I have something that can help them. You see what I'm saying? So um, all of a sudden the dream switched also, let me mention, the Russians actually did a cyber attack in my in my dream, where no one could use the ATM, but uh, we were able to use older cell phones, like the old flip phones from like year two thousand, year two thousand five. So old cell phones were or, or old technology was useful in this dream because the newer technology wasn't working. So all of a sudden the dream switched and now I was inside of this place, like inside of a boat of some sort. And I was, the soldiers were around and they were waiting for my instructions. So I told them, I said, okay, uh, I need a map because I need to pinpoint where we are. And so, so, you know, and that would help me figure out a plan to get out of New York City, okay? So they handed, handed me a tablet, and I looked at the tablet, and I was trying to download the, the GPS map. You know, we, if you use Google Maps, you need GPS. But like I said before, uh, the Russians did a cyber attack on the United States, so the communications and stuff wasn't working. So I started to hack. I started, like, doing codes or something to get into the, the tablet, to, to get into the, the system. And all of a sudden, one of the soldiers inside of the, the uh, boat who was with me, he started acting crazy. Like he started getting real belligerent. And I can't quite remember uh, exactly what happened to him, but I think the soldiers killed him. <clears throat> and I asked the question, I asked the, the, um, the, uh, one of the soldiers, I asked him, I said, was he a part of the Russian Mafia? And they said, yes. You have uh, the Russian Mafia is, uh, you have uh, uh, sleeper cells 
of Russian mafia in the United States who are actually helping Russia with an invasion invasion on the United States. I said, okay. So, uh, the dream switched again. Like, uh, I can't remember wh wh what happened after that. I'm not sure if I figured out how to get us out. But all of a sudden, the dream now, if you, when you have a dream and it just switches to, to the next. So, it just switched to the next. And all of a sudden, I was in this place that looks like a slaughterhouse. But the, 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 the bodies were human bodies. It was a, it looked like it looked kind of like a slaughterhouse, but uh, I, I saw the bodies that were humans, human bodies, and I got the impression that I was actually in hell. Uh, now I don't think that I actually died or anything in the dream. I think it, it was just like a vision to show me something that I didn't quite understand. But I'm starting to think that maybe uh, there's something going on in hell that is related to what was going on on the earth with world war i don't want to call it world i'm, I'm calling it world war three in the title but it almost looked like that's what was going on in his dream it was it was so intense it was a lot of a lot of destruction in a very short amount of time so um like i said the place where i was i believe it was hell and, uh, and that's after I woke up. And the crazy thing about this dream is, because I, I noticed this in other people who had the same dream, is how I actually woke up in the middle of this dream and went, went back to sleep. And the dream actually started off right where it left off. So, and that was crazy to me. So, I'm not sure if, that I've, if that's ever happened to me before. But, yeah, it, 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 the dream, I woke up and the dream started off back where it left off when I first woke up. So... Um, but like I said, it, also when I woke up, uh, in this dream, it was a very strong atmosphere of fear. Um, it was just, it was very evil. And even after I woke up from the dream, I still felt the fear. It was very intense, very intense dream. And, you know, um, I'm not sure 100% what it means. I'm not sure if, if maybe I'm just tripping. I don't know. Maybe just a dream. Maybe I've been watching too much movies. Uh, I don't know if it's if it's prophetic. Uh, I'm not a, a, a what you call it, a prophet or whatever. Um, or I don't I don't call myself a prophet. Uh, but that was a very interesting dream. And the reason why I made this video, I did I wasn't gonna make it at first, but when I saw the amount of videos on YouTube of other people having this same dream, especially this in the last couple months, I'm like, yeah. And some of the dream, some of the people who had dreams that I had even uh, witnessed, they or, or they described certain things that I also saw in this in the dream that I had. Um, but um, the thing that really kind of throws me off about the dream was the last part. You know, the 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 um the slaughterhouse part, which I think was hell. I believe it was hell. I believe that's where I was. But um, I, I, I'm, like I said, I'm, I'm starting to think that, that there's a connection between the, the war that I saw and hell. Like maybe a lot of souls were dying and a lot of people were going to hell during the dream. And, you know, the, 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 the bodies and the, the, I don't know. It, it was very evil and very sadistic. But um, I, I honestly also believe that um, the dream wasn't finished because I, when I woke up, I got the feeling that I was supposed to go back to sleep, but I didn't. So I do believe that I missed some information of the dream. But uh, I, uh, I just want to give y'all that part, even though I, I do believe that there was supposed to be a third, a third part of that dream that I didn't get because I, because I didn't go back to sleep. So, but anyway. I just want to give y'all this video. Uh, I just want to add to whatever. If you're a person who had a dream similar to this, I'm just letting this, letting you know that I definitely had a, a similar dream just a couple days ago. So literally a couple days ago, and I have no idea where this dream came from. It, it, it came out of nowhere. I've never even had a dream like this before in my life. 
I've, I've never had, I've never seen anything like this. And it was very intense, very realistic. Um, so, yeah, I just want to make make this video, and y'all can leave a comment in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think, and if you had any similar dreams to it. So, yeah, y'all can share this video if you want. I don't, I don't care.